Please take your seats quickly, ladies and gentlemen. Hi guys, and welcome to One Minute Tennis. Today I want to talk to you about the swing path on the forehand, and particularly the swing path for when the ball is a little bit high or when you're rushed and might possibly be late. I want to explain why the traditional way of explaining this is sometimes very difficult for many players and a really easy way of making extreme topspin on your forehand with safety, power and accuracy. Now the traditional way of explaining how to get topspin on the forehand is quite simply to swing from low to high. So if we imagine this ball is a clock face and I was hitting in this direction, then can we imagine that we have six at the bottom and 12 at the top and we swing from low to high from six to 12 making the stroke. And this is very effective for balls that are in a comfortable place, right in the perfect hitting zone, right at the perfect height. But you know, tennis isn't always like that. Tennis is a tough game. And many times the ball is not in the right place. The ball is difficult. It's, on, it's on, onto us too quickly. It's too high. Or we have an easy floated ball that we want to put away, but we still want to hit with some spin just to make sure we don't hit the ball long. Once again, if I turn around in this direction, still think of the ball as a clock face. But this time we're going to try and swing from three to nine. So instead of swinging from 6 to 12 up the ball, I swing from the outside of the ball and swing from 3 to 9 across the face of the ball. If you swing from 6 to 12, you will create topspin in a very simple and obvious manner. If you swing from 3 to 9 directly across the line of the ball, then even if the ball is high, 3 to 9, or is low, 3 to 9, you'll get very powerful and effective topspin. You see, if I swing 6 to 12 here, then it works fine. But if I sw swing 6 to 12 here, so the swing path of the high ball is still from low to high, it's kind of a weak position. I can't make a strong swing there. But if I swing from 3 to 9 on the high ball, then it's very easy to get tremendous racket speed and power, and yet I still get spin and effect on the ball. Try this swing path, it's very easy to do, and it's very, very effective. I've also not seen it spoken about very much online, so it might be something new for you or for your players. Let us know in the comments section how this works for you. As ever, we love your feedback, and we always reply to every single message. Remember to like, share, and subscribe the channel, please. It really helps us. And if you need more help with your game, remember we do one-to-one -one online consultations and the most detailed video analysis possible. It's a unique service. It's very personal, and it works. Hope you enjoyed today's session, and see you next time for more unique tennis lessons that really work.